Did you know that while Elon Musk founded SpaceX, he is not actually involved in the day-to-day -day management of the company? Instead, that role falls to Gwen Shotwell, the true leader of SpaceX. Her exceptional leadership is the primary reason for the company's continued success in achieving significant milestones. You may not be familiar with her name, but Mrs. Shotwell stands out as the most exceptional operator in the tech industry, and her contribution to SpaceX's remarkable achievements is undeniable. Join us as we delve into Gwen Shotwell's leadership approach and learn how she steered SpaceX to its towering success. Gwen Shotwell is presently serving as the President and Chief Operating Officer officer of SpaceX, a position she has held since 2008. However, before joining SpaceX, she had a remarkable career in the aerospace industry, working for companies such as Aerospace Corporation and Microcosm Inc. In addition, she also taught at the Aerospace Engineering Department at the University of Southern California for some time. Interestingly, Mrs. Shotwell did not have a predetermined aspiration to work in the aerospace industry when she was a young girl. Nevertheless, she had an early fascination with engineering that sparked her interest. Elon Musk is renowned for his ambitious objectives, but it is Gwen Shotwell who translates those visions into reality. As companies grow significantly, many founders employ adult supervision. For example, Mark Zuckerberg hired Sheryl Sandberg as his chief operating officer in 2008 when Facebook was only a few years old. Despite Gwen Shotwell's impressive engineering skills, earning Elon Musk's trust to oversee SpaceX was not an easy feat. Mrs. Shotwell had accumulated over 10 years of experience in the aerospace industry before joining SpaceX. Initially, she was hired for a sales position as the head of business development. However, Elon had complete knowledge of the business and valued her judgment, which led to her involvement in more significant and challenging projects. As the company grew, handling new responsibilities became increasingly challenging. Nonetheless, Mrs. Shotwell recognizes that developing a diverse skill set is vital for effective leadership, and one cannot acquire new skills without taking risks and trying new things. Starting the company from scratch would have been impossible, but thanks to Shotwell's successful execution of multiple initiatives, SpaceX now has a real chance of achieving it, albeit several years down the line. In 2002, when I was considering working with SpaceX, I deliberated over my decision for weeks. I was a part-time single mother at the time, so this was much outside my comfort zone. In Los Angeles, I was on the motorway when it finally dawned on me that I was acting like a complete moron. Who cares if I attempted this job and failed, or the business did, or both? At that very moment, I realized that the difficult aspect was actually the most important. Attempt that dangerous thing. Participate in something fun. The door must be opened when opportunity knocks. Despite almost two decades of hard work, SpaceX still had a long way to go. However, Gwen Shotwell discovered a remarkable breakthrough that would enable the company to approach its business in an entirely new manner and ultimately transform it into a lucrative rocket firm. Mrs. Shotwell emphasizes the concept of residual capability, which may be unfamiliar to some. Despite its seemingly technical language, the concept is easy to understand. Residual capability involves developing preposterous business lines around existing technology to support more long-term endeavors. This approach is the cornerstone of Shotwell's success. In fact, the concept of residual capability serves as the foundation for the entire design philosophy of SpaceX's Big Falcon rocket. SpaceX has benefited significantly from residual capability in a few notable cases. For instance, their satellite internet network, Starlink, is a prime example. Although SpaceX's primary objective is to make human life multi-planetary, Starlink's establishment as an internet service provider was not the primary goal. Although the internet is impressive, it is not directly related to Mars exploration. This was the general belief until Gwen Shotwell formulated SpaceX's business plan. Since a journey to Mars is a costly endeavor requiring a large rocket, Mrs. Shotwell began breaking down Elon's concept into smaller, more feasible components that could eventually lead to the establishment of a colony on the Red Planet. We have all witnessed SpaceX launching satellites for other companies, but Gwen Shotwell gradually realized that by launching their satellites, SpaceX could establish a self-sustaining business on Earth while simultaneously developing the necessary technology for Mars exploration. 
Foundation. The establishment of a Starlink network would require a substantial investment of billions of dollars to launch a fleet of satellites into orbit. However, once in orbit, these satellites could generate revenue for many years. Furthermore, the knowledge acquired from building satellite networks on Earth could be applied to create a communication network for a potential Martian colony. Having previously spearheaded a partnership with Iridium in 2010, Gwen Shotwell was the perfect candidate to lead SpaceX's Starlink initiative. Despite SpaceX's strong relationships with government clients, Mrs. Shotwell recognized the importance of doing business with private companies. In 2010, she struck a $492 million deal with Iridium to launch 75 of their satellites into orbit using Falcon 9 rockets. Mrs. Shotwell's astute understanding of residual capabilities enabled her to leverage SpaceX's existing technology to launch a new business line with Starlink in 2015, ultimately increasing the company's revenue. When asked whether it's Gwen time or Elon time now, Gwen answered that it is indeed Gwen time. Although Elon may push for faster growth, Gwen's response highlights her leadership and influence at SpaceX. According to Mrs. Shotwell, Musk has a reputation for setting unrealistic deadlines while maintaining lofty ambitions. Many people tend to disregard his aggressive timelines as unachievable. However, Gwen acknowledges that although Musk's deadlines may be unrealistically optimistic, she believes that his vision for technology is accurate and fully supports his plan. While Musk is known for being a demanding boss, Mrs. Shotwell has been working with him for nearly two decades and wouldn't have stayed if they didn't share a common goal for the company. Another essential attribute that makes Gwen Shotwell an outstanding leader at SpaceX is her enthusiasm for absurd goals. Make utterly absurd goals and strive to attain them. Don't be scared to fail if you can't. The notion of setting unrealistic goals can be compelling, driven largely by psychological factors. This is linked to Parkinson's Law, an age-old adage that posits that work tends to expand to fill the available time. In other words, the effort required to complete a task increases proportionally with the time allotted to complete it. For instance, if the SpaceX team were to state that reaching Mars would be incredibly challenging and would take 50 years, they would likely spend the entire 50 years working on the project. Although setting a lofty goal may attract criticism from some, it poses little actual risk. The key is to persistently work towards that objective, which can lead to remarkable accomplishments. Elon Musk is renowned for setting exceptionally audacious goals, whereas Gwen Shotwell tends to be more prudent in her predictions. This is understandable, as she must ensure the company stays operational. It is worth noting that despite her more cautious approach, Shotwell is still fully aligned with Musk's vision. She shares his aptitude for long-term planning and the ability to envision possibilities for humanity over decades rather than just years. While Shotwell has amassed a substantial fortune, it is believed her motivation to continue stems from a desire to improve the quality of life for future generations. As a mother, she has expressed the wish for her grandchildren. Therefore, even if SpaceX is unable to achieve all its goals during her lifetime, it's believed she will be recognized for centuries as someone who made a lasting impact on human history. Shotwell's significance to SpaceX goes beyond her professional achievements. Her leadership style is renowned for being no-nonsense and results-driven. She is unafraid of making tough choices and is always on the lookout for ways to enhance the company's operations and procedures. However, what makes Shotwell particularly indispensable to SpaceX is her shared vision with Elon Musk for the future of space exploration. Both are firm believers in humanity becoming a multi-planetary species, and they see SpaceX as a key player in making that ambition a reality. Shotwell has played a critical role in helping Musk realize that vision, and her leadership has been instrumental in positioning SpaceX as a leader in the space industry.